Hola, Minasan! Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back for another round of freelance gaming. How are y'all doing? Are you doing good? I'm doing good. And we're back for another round of Nuzlocke. Nuzlocke, Nuzlocke, Nuzlocke. Oh my gosh, it's been a couple of months since uh, um, I was Nuzlocking. <laughs> I'm still on my fourth run, my fourth attempt. At Nuzlocking, oh my gosh, Fire Red, it, it had been one heck of a nightmare uh, to do. <laughs> it was a horror, uh, it was a horror show, because um, I kept losing at Cerulean City the first three times, uh, and then for some reason, hey, welcome to the show, little man. Who's got a Steam Deck? Santa Claus got a Steam Deck. That, that's who got, a, who got a Steam Deck. <laughs> Welcome to the show. You know what I say? <laughs> oh my gosh. So, yeah, even even taking on um, uh, my stupid rival, in uh, after I selected my, my, my first Pokemon, uh, he freaking got a critical hit on me and took me out in that first uh, first battle in Gary Oaks. Uh, <laughs> Uh, Gary Oak's office, so it got ridiculous. It got ridiculous, so... <laughs> I finally made it very, very, very far. Opened the world up by... Um, let's see. Yeah, the fourth one was uh, was crazy. The fourth one, uh, the fourth run right now is very crazy. Lots and lots of miracles. Um, so many miracles. <laughs> and so now I'm at an impasse where... I gotta get my Pokemon leveled up before I can take on um, the next set of trainer gym uh, gym leaders, and try and get some more free Pokemon from some of these guys. Build up some money because I need to buy flamethrower for Flareon because I didn't know Flareon didn't come with a flamethrower. Ah for... <laughs> oh, man, so how's your Steam Deck, Ilman? How you enjoying it? Is it really good? Does it live up to the hype? <laughs> Let's see here. <clears throat> Make sure everything is good before we begin. So today, I'm from where I left off. <laughs> uh, from where I left off, I'm going to be taking on these random trainers out in the field. I'm taking a big risk because taking on trainers, you know, they're so unpredictable and they can uh, destroy me and obliterate me and if they do obliterate me um, it's game over and I'll have to do it again <laughs> so here's how the scavenging is going to work out um, here because uh, there's only uh, there's only three weeks left of January <laughs> and I didn't open up uh, and I didn't create a schedule for February um, because I don't know what's going to happen with this Nuzlocke. So what's going to happen is this. Because it's uh, Wednesdays and Thursdays. Um, between now and the 31st. 31st being Wednesday. And then February 1st begins on Thursday. Uh, if I get far enough. Between now and the 31st. Uh, between now and the 31st. If I get like. If I'm like one gym leader away from going up against the Elite Four. Uh, then um, then I will continue into February. But if I still end up with a long way to go, uh, and I mean a very long way to go, well, it'll still be a long way to go. Like, if I have to deal with Blaine and and, and, uh, and Giovanni um, by the time, uh, you know, and I don't get to deal with them by the time I hit January 31st, then I'm going to put this on the, on the shelf until March. Uh, so that way I could dedicate February to playing my other consoles. But um, the Nuzlocke takes so much time. It really does take up a lot of time, and I do have other consoles that I wanna um, I wanna put to uh, put put to use for all of you uh, to be entertained. Uh, this month was a very odd month. Um, maybe I should have saved the Nuzlocke for February, but um, I didn't want to um, hold off. Uh, I didn't want to hold um, hold it out for two two consecutive months. 
Um, that's the reason why I'm jumping in on this. Um, basically. <laughs> so it all depends on um, on how much I can survive. If I end up losing, if I end up losing again, um, I'll have to save. I'll save the fifth attempt for another for a later date, and maybe do. Um, uh, maybe a much much more later date, and so that way I can uh, play uh, Pokemon Legends Arceus. I've been wanting to play that on the Switch, not a Nuzlocke, but just a regular playthrough. Since I had completed my um, uh, Brilliant Diamond Nuzlocke, which was my first ever Nuzlocke last year, so that's what's gonna happen regarding Pokemon. If I end up losing again, uh, I'm gonna hold off on doing another a Nuzlocke and do a regular Pokemon um, playthrough for all of you, which will be Arceus Legends, and then go back to Nuzlocking. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna resume this Nuzlocke. I'm probably gonna play um, Fire Red. I'll probably go to another game, uh, another Pokemon game to Nuzlocke, because I got some new, po you know, I, I went out of my way to buy um, Sword and Violet, and I left them unopened for uh, on purpose for a reason, which means I missed out on the gold uh, points, uh, <laughs> on those precious sweet succulent gold points that I could have gotten. Uh, so yeah, the, um, those are the Pokemon. Po Ooh, excuse me. Oh. Ooh. So those are the Pokemon plants <laughs> in a nutshell. <laughs> those are the Pokemon plants in a nutshell. Um, yeah, I do want to get into that Pokemon Legends Arceus because it's set in the same, um, you know, it's connected to Brilliant Diamond. It's in it's in the Sinnoh region, and I uh, and I really love pro um, uh, the the Platinum uh, version of Pokemon Pokemon Platinum. I really enjoyed that. <laughs> it's like that's my favorite. Uh, that's my favorite of all the Pokemon uh, mainline games. It's Platinum. It was very well done, very well executed. And it was great to get to uh, Nuzlocke uh, Brilliant Diamond, which is <clears throat> um, a remarkable experience. And and so is Fire Red because, who boy, who boy, is this a, has this been tough? <laughs> has this been tough? Um, so it looks like uh, the Steam Deck is, um, is really fun. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Enjoy your new Steam Deck. <laughs> Uh, right, let's see. Looks like everything's in order here. Uh, okay. So for those of you uh, on the other side um, that I'm watching here, the the kickicks, the kickicks, uh, welcome. Welcome to uh, the uh, gaming show. <laughs> uh, you've seen the Japanese live stream. You've seen the Let's Read live stream. Now here's the gaming live stream. <laughs> Uh, kicking it off with a Nuzlocke, right? <laughs> so, uh, let me pull uh, the rules up for you. So, the thing about uh, me, me and Nuzlocke's is that I don't have a problem with coming here from time to time uh, to get uh, a little assistance uh, for, uh, uh, for Pokemon. Because preparation takes a lot, and, uh, I'm, and unlike most Nuzlockers who knows all the intricacies of EVs, uh, you know, have it all memorized in their head precisely which EV uh, a, a Dunsparce has, <laughs> and and how many EVs it'll take to get to the next EV level. I don't have that. Uh, I don't have that. Um, so I go to Sarah B here. To, to prep up and everything for any um, any uh, trainer fights and such. Uh, as for the uh, as for the rules at large, uh, those of you over on the kick kicks, uh, I'm curious about uh, uh, how my Nuzlocke uh, operates. Uh, standard base rules are is always always going to be in effect. For those of you new to Nuzlocke, it's a challenge. Um, it's a it's a video game challenge, very popular among Pokemon players. Uh, and the way it works, uh, the base rules is that the first new Pokemon encountered in a new area is the only Pokemon that can be cap uh, captured. Um, I modified that a little bit for two attempts per area because there's no actual attempt limit. And I don't want to sit there over and over again waiting for that one Pokemon, that one new Pokemon. Not good, uh, you know, not much of a challenge if you could do all that. Uh, not only that, but if a Pokemon faints, it dies and it cannot be revived and most people um, normally would um, use the 
um, release uh, option in which your Pokemon goes away forever. But um, no, I uh, I use the taxidermist. <laughs> I send my Pokemon to the taxidermist. Uh, as for the house rules, um, as for the house rules, uh, basically depending on which game it is, if the game has a, a time cycle, um, since I play my uh, primarily at night, um, I get trapped at playing at night. Uh, so nighttime uh, is the is the only um, uh, course of action I could take. That uh, Fire Red doesn't have the nighttime cycle, so I'm not stuck in that issue. But I did have that problem in Brilliant Diamond. Found myself dealing with um, only capturing Pokemon at night, and that's going to be standard fare for the house rules, even though it's not in it. Uh, it's just something that happens. Uh, with regards to duplicate Pokemon, uh, duplicate Pokemon must be dead uh, to capture the same Pokemon when entering a new area. So I cannot uh, capture two of the same life Pokemon as per the um, base rules. But if a Pokemon is dead and sent to the Taxidermist, I can get a duplicate and uh, start over from there. Uh, Safari Zone, which I've already completed, but I can uh, but I have restricted myself to two new Pokemon uh, that can be captured. No duplicates. Uh, and the capture uh, the capture lock rule uh, does not apply, so I could do as many attempts as I want um, uh, that I wanted, but I could only get two, and only two. Uh, event Pokemon. Uh, with regards to event Pokemon, um, any Pokemon that are gifted to me, like say a fossil Pokemon or a one-time um, encounter, like say Mewtwo or Kyogre, uh, or any uh, other non-field uh, um, situation. Uh, doesn't count towards the um, two attempts per area rule um, uh, that I have up above. Uh, so in this case here, uh, when I went to Celadon City, uh, I could, I could um, get all the Pokemon that I wanted, but I kind of um, kind of adjusted that rule because that would have been too easy for me to cat um, to get. So I just uh, applied the Safari uh, Zone rule to that and got myself two Pokemon um, out of it instead of all the Pokemon. But um, but I can also go, I think Celadon has um, a pond, so I can still go and fish in Celadon City, so it's not locked out to me, even though I caught that, um, caught that Pokemon. So, uh, same goes for the fossils, um, wherever I got the fossils at, um, if it was near a pool, um, I could go to the pool, well, no, I, can, I, I could have actually caught myself a Pokemon in that area if I wanted to, um, where I got the, the fossils at. Um, wherever I turned the fossils at, I think that was uh, Cinnabar Island. Yeah, so if I were to go to the bar island and make the uh, and and get the fossil back to normal, I could still fish because it doesn't count. Uh, training arc. This is a this is a standard uh, house rule is start, that I started up in uh, Pokemon uh, in my first Nuzlocke. So each area is limited to 15 minutes. Uh, I spent 15 minutes in that area leveling up my uh, Pokemon, and once the, those 15 minutes are up, I have to go to another area and do another level up session there before returning to the same area. Um, I created this rule so that um, you guys won't have to sit there and watch me spend two hours uh, in the same area um, over and over again. Sometimes I'll jump between two areas, but, um, but I try to go to as many different areas as possible for 15 minutes each. So that way your eyes won't have to repetitively keep seeing me <laughs> um, be in the same area over and over and over again. Um, uh, and, so, and also keep the show looking fresh um, whenever I do the level up sessions. Uh, as for uh, game over, uh, game over is when I have no living Pokemon available in my team and or, uh, or uh, adult, um the taxidermist uh, is full, uh, which is one Pokemon box. So if the if the taxidermist fills up completely, um, then I lose automatically. Uh, if um, if I have no uh, living Pokemon available, uh, you know, like they're all dead. <laughs> Uh, that's it. Uh, that's a game over. Uh, another rule I forgot to add in for the game over part is that if I ran out of... Well, no, that's not true. No, that's not true. It's just all dead. Um, that was, that's archaic. Sorry, I was just thinking of an archaic rule. It doesn't exist no more. Uh, finally, with, with regards to gym leaders in League 4, um, gym leaders, I only ha um, I get three chances. So if, I, if my team gets wiped out, I can still go and take on the gym leader uh, two more times. 
after the third time then it's a game over but with the elite four um it's only one chance and only one chance just to balance out um just to balance it all out so if i lose to the elite four that's it game over and i gotta start from scratch start all over again um it's a fair balance because i am giving myself multiple chances for gym leaders rather than um most nuzlockers do where if they lose to a gym leader they start from scratch um and because i'm giving myself three chances you know which makes logical sense because i am running out of pokemon at this point um within these three chances so either i lose all my pokemon or or i lose three times uh either way uh if i lose three times to one gym leader uh i should have said three chances per gym leader sorry i'll have to um you know what let me i could correct that it's supposed to be three chances per gym leader not three chances versus the gym leaders uh, although that's a challenge in and of itself but considering uh, misty <laughs> considering uh, the difficulty with misty um, it's pretty uh, it's pretty intense um, it's, it's supposed to really because um, I really meant I mean, I, three, three, um, three chances per. Yeah, I should make that a little bit more clearer. It's three chances per uh, per gym leader. So let me just do this so it could be nice and clear. Because um, I I do have it right. I just have it worded um, vaguely. Dang it! Why? Why? Am I cut back? Back my. There we go. Yes. All right, that's a little bit more clear. Three chances per gym leader, uh, and one chance versus uh, the elite four. Uh, if the if attempts fail, then it's a game over. So if I fail all three attempts against one gym leader, uh, that's it. And if uh. And if I lose to the Elite Four once, that's it. So that's just to balance out the the rules. How do I close that up? I need that open. I might be getting more uh, more Pokemon. Okay. So yeah, those are the uh, those are the Nuzlocke rules uh, for this. And it is definitely um, pretty challenging because I did lose to Misty <laughs> three times, and I freaking lost to. Um, my rival in Professor Oaks <laughs> in Professor Oaks's um, uh, lab due to due to the computer having the luck which was so annoying there we go I just want to make sure everything is all set and we're gonna get uh, get moving Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. So I still have areas um, to capture Pokemon in. Um, I, uh, there's fishing in Celadon, the, um, fishing or swimming in Celadon City, Saffron City, Fuchsia City. Then I still have Route 13, 14, 17, 18, 19, uh, Cycling Road. I think, yeah, I think those are the last areas left. Those are the last areas left, which is um, pretty intense, <laughs> all things considered. Um, so yeah, this is my nose look out in a nutshell. Uh, it's st there's still room for improvement, uh, basically. So, the rules, uh, um, the rules may change on the next nose, uh, next nose like, well, 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 not change, change, but be adjusted. Um, pending on um, on the situation, so yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, welcome all, welcome all, and I hope you enjoy um, this nice like. And you can head on over uh, to my YouTube channel, Go Kisan. Uh, my main channel, the gaming channel, and you can catch uh, the rest of the Nuzlocks, all the Nuzlocks, if you want to see them uh, so far. 
and watch me suffer and <laughs> and struggle. <laughs> All right, so uh, let's begin. All right, I'm in Lavender Town. I need to know what I'm dealing with here. Oops. There we go. All right. Who do I have out here? Nobody. I'm walking around with nobody. <laughs> Nobody's in here. All right. So I'm trying to level up these guys. I want them evolved before I make any attempts. Uh, here's the living. Uh, here's at the. Here's who's at the taxidermist so far. <laughs> This is everybody who's at the taxidermist. That's two lines. One, two, three. Three more lines. I gotta be careful not to let those um, get filled out. Let the taxidermist get filled out. Mm, so, what was I... What did I have uh, planned? So, let's see here. Because um, I do... Uh, um, the intent is to fight the other one. But I was trying to level... Um, this team here. Um, aside from getting flamethrower, let's see. Uh, execute. Now I have the leaf uh, stone, so I can evolve execute at any time. Let's see here. Gen. What is it? Gen three. Uh, fire red leaf green. Yeah, here we go. Gen three. So, I do have the stone, but what was I holding off on? You can get solar beam at 43. Confusion at 19. Let's look at the... Let me just take a quick look here. Yeah, he does have the confusion. And the solar beam is at level... Um, the solar beam is at level 43. So, uh, I wonder what I'm holding off on. Because when he turns into Executor, and I could give him Sunny Day so I can use Solar Beam easy, uh, along with Confusion. What other Psychic Attacks he can use? Um, he, can, he can use Psychic itself. Alright. 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 There we go. Mm, add Nettie. Your, um, yours another one that I can evolve now because I got the Moonstone. Um, your the Nidorino, Nidorino. What was it about you? Uh, not Nidorino, Nidorina. Nah. So I need you your. Speaking of your, where is, where is your? <laughs> There we go. <laughs> um, Gen three. What was I? Why was I holding off on? She doesn't have much of anything. I got the bite. Um. Oh, here we are. Crunch is the is her highest move. Can she learn crunch? No, she won't get crunch, but she gets superpower. Gotcha. If um, once she's a needle queen, um, there's a chance that's superpower. Hmm. I can learn a heck of a lot of moves. Not bad. Not bad. Hmm. Um, who exactly am I going? Oh, right. Let's see, and I need Namira. Hmm. There is so, so much. Um, Dratini. Oh, it acknowledged my misspell. 
trying to figure all this out. Dratini. Um, Dratini, level 25. Slam is the next move. Uh, Will it, um, Dragon Air learn? It'll take a long time to learn some of these moves. Outrage is uh, level 56, huh? Alright. Then, uh, the best thing for me to do right now is just continue leveling them up along the way and figure out what to do from there. Mmm. <clears throat> Lumi. Mm. Alright, so I'm looking to get everybody up to um into the thirties. That's um Wow, alright. Hmm. Yeah, because everybody's at twenty five at the moment. And then I got Zuzuka. Raise the speed in the rain. Mm, what was it about you? Mm. You become a king drum after using. Let's see, you gotta hold the dragon scale, huh? Gotcha. I gotta have you holding the dragon scale. Yeah, got dragon dance, uh, hydro pump, twister. What would you learn here? As, uh,. Cedra, same thing. When do you evolve though? 32. Huh, you, you evolve at level 32, huh? You get Twister at a. Okay, Twister's at level 29. Hmm. This is. A whole lot of strategizing. <laughs> a whole lot of strategizing, everybody. Let's see. Hmm. Hmm. What kind of moves you got? Hmm. Dragon Rage, Leo Twister. Oh, you already got the Twister. Cool. So it's just a matter of getting you evolved. It's a matter of getting everybody evolved. Mm. Like a Leaf Stone. You, I need to get Flamethrower. <laughs> um, let's see. How is it that Flareon cannot learn Flamethrower? Of all, of all the moves, of all the moves, Flareon doesn't learn Flamethrower. And so, um... Oh yeah, Flamethrower at 52. Never mind. Uh, sorry. Um, that wasn't the attack I was thinking of. That was something else. Um, yeah, Darwin can learn it at 52. That's a long way to go. 25. I'm halfway there. <laughs> it was Ember that I missed out on. Huh? Fire spin is, until, is not until 36 and it's not a very good thing. Uh, sorry. Uh, I wanted to get Flamethrower earlier instead of... Um, that's right. That, you know what? Um, I'm not going to worry about it. I'll just work it through. Yeah. All right. Mm. 
Okay, so let me take the mirror. Try to get um get Suzuka up to twenty five. Um the level of these guys at twenty six. Okay, so I'm gonna get these guys up to twenty six first. And Suzuka up to twenty five. I'm surprised I didn't get her up to twenty five. I'm not sure when I should um, evolve your though. Mm. Let's take Kirkwind. And Darwin. Hmm. Let's see. Where would be the best place to. Alright. So now I gotta. Go and find. Oh. All right. Well, let me check the map here. Where's the map at? Oh, here we go. Town map. All right. I'm here. Let's see. Gym battles everywhere. Have I taken um, any gym tra um, any trainers here? Um, there's trainers here, but I don't remember what level they are. To route eight, let's. Uh, what level are they in? I don't want to go to an over level fight. I'll definitely lose. It. All right, level twenty twos, twenty fours. All right, I can handle these guys. I should have no trouble taking these guys on. There's a whole lot of them. All right. So Route 8 it is. Gonna go in and take on these trainers. And uh, pray I don't lose any Pokemon. All right. What do I have at the point? Um... Okay. Alright. There we go. Start leveling the uh, Pokemon up. If I could clean this route up, I can move around a little better. Alright, here's Grimer. Level 22? Good. Okay. I should be able to have a good fight going on here. Smoke screen. Blind it. Alright, upped its uh, regular defense. Is bubble. Wait, I have water gun now. Why do I throw bubble? <laughs> oh, he reduced. Well, I do have a psychic type anyway, so I could just flash it out of uh, out of existence. Nope, you missed. I blinded you, smoke screen. <laughs> I think I might keep smoke screen. It's very very efficient. Ooh, and there goes the water gun. a good start. Um, I'm gonna say no. I'm gonna do a sw uh, swap out. Bring in Mimeon. Use Confusion. Okay, there's Sludge. Great. Poison. One quick uh, confusion. Mm. Bag. Um, 
um, super potion. Or should I swap out? You know what? I think I'll swap out. I hate the idea of swapping out because then. But you know what? All right, let me try super potion real quick. And it goes to Sable. Ah, uh, there goes the confusion. Great. Uh, this ain't gonna. All right, let me just max go with it. No. Another sludge. All right, swap out. Fine, I'll swap out. Uh, bring Kirkland. Dang that, Minimines. Here's a confusion. Good, he's gone. Yes, please. Uh, let's bring Suzuka back. Thankfully, I have an antidote, so I'm not gonna lose um, my immune. Another smoke screen. Really? Water gun. Minimized. Alright. Crap. Alright, gonna have to switch. Quickly. Pokemon I had a premium right now. <laughs> so yeah, I gotta try and get these guys up to level 30. So I could deal with um uh, some of these guys here. Um, in the cities, Bruno and his gym, um, his martial arts gym. Gotta be able to deal with the. Uh... Isn't there one more person I had to take on? Hey, there we go. Alright, that's fine. It's not logical. Okay, antidote. Let's get that antidote. There we go. And retreat. take long to get to 30 oh my gosh this is insane all right how much further this should you have to go 870 all right just so that way these guys can be able to handle oh boy Alright, got twins here. Mm, the is the slowest out of everybody. Oh, yeah, well, Kirkland's also the slowest out of everybody. Hmm, I still don't know if I should just evolve Kirkland right away. i wait until 30. Anyway, let's do a fight. There we go. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> okay. They have electric Pokemon. One each. Oh, okay. Kofari and Jigglypuff. Good. Alright, we're good. We're good. Mm. Thunder Wave. Let's just paralyze them. <laughs> and blind it. <laughs> it's like, ah! 
you got Clefairy like all frazzed down there. Jigglypuff is all frazzed down. Clefairy's like, ah, ah, ah. <laughs> <laughs> Blind them and paralyze them. <laughs> what a nasty combination to be blinded and paralyzed. Alright, and now we'll show uh, Water Gun them. And. Twister. What a nasty combination, man. <laughs> oh, they were able to do something. <laughs> um, to now with the twister. Just hitting both at the same time. Lynched, nice. Oh, there goes disabled. Dang. Oh, bubble can hit both of them. Oh, okay. Well, then we'll hit them both at the same time. <laughs> All right. Ooh. Critical hit, nice. There goes Jigglypuff. That minimizes annoying. Avoid the attack. Avoid this. <laughs> Good fight. Oh. It is disabled no more. Water gun. <laughs> Use follow me. Came the center of attention. Alright. Wanted attention? Here's a twister. <laughs> Alright, cool. And I got some money. So much needed money. That sweet succulent money. <laughs> Shook those kids down for uh, for five hundred uh, poke bucks. Give me that money, kid. <laughs> Let's see. Next one should be um, poison Pokemon. Let's get a look here. Hmm. Almost there to 25. Okay. Yeah. I fear this may end up being uh, an all night session to get the um, to get them up to 30. Let's um Let me take a Let me take a quick look here at the the gym leaders. Uh, Sabrina. Sabrina's the next gym leader, right? Um, okay, gym leaders. Thank you. Uh, let's see here. I took down Erica. It's still Koga. Oh, I gotta go and fight Koga before I take on Sabrina, right? So uh, his Pokemon. Oh my gosh, level 37. 39, 37, 43. Wow. And the only reason why I took down Erica so easily is because I had fire type uh, attacks. Yeah, everybody, this is going to be a very, very, very long training session. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to have anything done. 
I'm not gonna get anything done until I get uh, my Pokemon up to 40 and handle these uh, these monsters. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Dar, Dar. <laughs> oh wow! Yeah, got this whole line of uh, people. We must look silly standing here like this. Yes, you do. That's why we're gonna beat you all up and take your money. <laughs> oh, five Pokemon. Okay. <clears throat> we got five Pokemon. Smoke screen. Oh, dang. Accurate, uh, prevented accuracy loss. No problem. One water gun coming up. At least uh, Pidgey's like level 19. Oh, <laughs> Pidgey's like, no, get this out of here. Alright, well, you brought out a <laughs> you brought out a dragon, so here's some rage. <laughs> Alright. So this is gonna need uh XP. So this is gonna need to get to the next level. Uh, let's uh, smoke screen again. <laughs> I'm blind. I'm blind. <laughs> oh crap, Pepper Fang. Oh good. Oh good. So Zuka held up. Another quick attack. Okay, no critical hit. Whew. I worry about those. Almost there. A Pikachu. I'll switch out. Let me just uh, make sure. All right. Um, I could play. I could use Kirkling. Hmm. Sure. You know what? I'll switch with your. Mm, double team. Ooh. Alright, let's bite. That's alright. Poison Sting. Should have went with Poison Sting. Alright, let's go back to bite. <laughs> that evasiveness is starting to, uh, starting to be a pain in the butt. There we go. Gone. Yes, please. Um, yeah, I'll switch with Kirkland. Kirkland's, um, Kirkland's confusion should uh, dispatch it. Uh-oh. He's got Peck. He's got Walter Peck. Oh, I got confusion. <laughs> Gone. Super effective. Good. This is kind of hit level 25. Alright. Meow. Okay, I'll have to bring, um, bring her out. Mm, what do I want? Minion or Namira? I'll bring Namira out. Dragon Ray. Twister.
There we go. You did my porky Pokemon. Well, you were the one that came at me. <laughs> you approached me when I passed by. See? Look where I'm at. And you walked all the way over and started messing with me. Who do you think you are, huh? Huh? No, seriously, who do you think you are? Hmm? Don't be messing with me. <laughs> the lasses are so annoying. They're like, why did you hurt my poor Pokemon? Well, why did you bother me? I was just walking by, minding my business. <laughs> Why are you even Pokemon fighting if you're so worried about uh, your Pokemon getting hurt? <laughs> okay, so everybody's uh, uh, is now 25 and above. Let me jump over here for a second. Uh, move Pokemon. Okay. So 26, 28, 26, 25. Ednetti needs to. Just to catch up to these two. Oh my god. I need a good spot for proper training. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, I know a spot where I can do training. Uh, how am I doing with the money, though? Where's my finances? Where's my finances? 3,000! I need more! <laughs> I need more money. Um, definitely need more money. Hmm. Yeah, it feels like, uh, it feels like a chore at this point. Um... Knowing that the gym leaders are clocking in at 37, between 37 and 39, no, 43 actually. Koga is between 37 and 43. Sabrina's between also 37 and 43. That's annoying. That is definitely annoying. All right. Hmm. At this rate, mm, what would be a good tra uh, training strategy? Should I just stay focused on one whole Pokemon and just go one Pokemon at a time until they hit thirty, and then take and then do the next uh, next Pokemon? Hmm. I mean, this isn't a um, hmm. Hmm. Let me let me fly first. No, I'm not move items. Although I do need to get them to hold items, but here we go. So I can fly. I'm a peacock. Let me fly. <laughs> Cause sure, I can take on the the trainers at this point. It's not wrong, but I think maybe I should get my. Pokemon oh. fly. Try to get them to a certain point. Yeah, see, I I, I could go everywhere but Cinnabar, um, uh, Cinnabar Island. I need to fly, and I still gotta save Lapras. I still gotta save Lapras. I still gotta get Hitmonchan or Hitmon Lee. <laughs> I'm going for Hitmonchan. I want the punchies. Uh. And I think there was one more Pokemon that I needed to... One more free Pokemon to get. Aside from Mewtwo, of course. <laughs> oh, uh, that's right. The Helix. Uh, Omastar. Uh, Omanite. That's it. Those are the one. Th those are the only free Pokemon I think are left. Um, oh, yes. And also Snorlax. I still gotta do another round of Snorlax. Snorlax killed one of my Pokemon. Dang it. Mm. Alright, let me come over here to the rock tunnel. I had a good training session up there. Like, I really was leveling up Pokemon quick. Mm. 
Yeah, the stark difference between um, between the current generation where like, everyone, um, where they install experience all to uh, <laughs> to all the Pokemon, as opposed to here where I have to find experience all in order to share the share the wealth. Do a 15 minute session here. Again. I don't know, can I still get plenty enough um, XP out of this? Mm. I don't know, should I try another area? Well, let me just do this. I mean, I am getting 100. Oh my gosh, full torp. It's not very effective. Alright, oh, that sonic boom. Let me just run. I forgot about the blasted sonic boom. I would have to um, kill 17 Pokemon to get to 26, 16, 15, 13, 18, 19. Um, just so they can level up. I need I need an area that can do 200. That's what I need. Hmm. Cause this will take forever if I deal, um, I need to double, I need to get double the, the XP. Alright, let me look at some of these routes here. I might have to do some, uh, I'll have to fight some of the trainers. Um, to um, clear the clear the path out for me to do a training session. Fuchsia City. <clears throat> Fifteen, fourteen, and thirteen, um, which I've already. Oh right, I didn't cover thirteen and fourteen. Is that because I already have those Pokemon? That's why I didn't do a capture. Yeah, um, what a wild Pokemon out there. Uh. Let's see, there's Tentacool, if I want to try and grab it. Uh, Psyduck, I have the Super Rod, so I have a chance at a Krabby, Psyduck, Slowpoke. Uh, wait, what route is this? 13? So yeah, I have a chance at a Krabby, Slowpoke, Psyduck. Mm -hmm, not sure if that's something I want to do. Um, there's also Ditto. Don't know why I would want Ditto, but Venonat is something I would probably want. Or Bell Slot. Mm, Venonat. Uh, and then what was it with 14? And how powerful are these trainers? Um, 27? 
28, 29. Too powerful. These guys are clocking in at 20, uh, 26 to 29. In 30s. Oh, too many of them. Way too many trainers. How did I manage to get a, uh, get a, uh, get past them? <laughs> and there's a Weeping Bell. Well, uh, no, there's a Gloom, a Ditto, Venonette available. I already, uh, I could recapture Pidgey. I could recapture Pidgey because I, because uh, I lost Pidgey. Oh, that's just the only one. <clears throat> so I'm trying to figure out here. Uh, what level are these guys too? Oh, they're very high level. Gotcha. The minimum level is 22. The max level is 20. Uh, 22 to 30. And what about these guys here? Uh, 15 for the fishing, but could end up with a level 35 Psyduck with a Super Rod. <laughs> uh, they're within range, um, actually. 22 to 26. 30 is the highest level, that's Gloom. And if I draw Gloom. Uh, and Route 15, let's go through 15 here. Because I gotta be able to... Route 15 is between 22 and 30. So 14 is the hardest one then. Interesting. Um, well, mm, they seem to be in the right area. Hmm. Should I, uh, um, should I chance that? Hmm. Well, I do have uh, Firo. And I've already covered Route 15 in terms of um, Pokemon hunting. I just fear the trainers more than anything else. Alright, let me just see here. Let me just take a quick look at what I'm dealing with. Then a gnat, level 26. Yeah, I'm, um, I'm only short by one level. Alright, I'm off by a, a single level. Ooh, no, that's a, is that a, is that a bug type? No, no, okay. Smokescreen. Alright, but at least I'm faster than uh, Venonat here. Switch with Ace right now. Oh, just in time. Poison powder, huh? Takes ten. Peck. Gone. Oh man. I just realized I don't have an antidote. Oh. Wait. I may not have an antidote, but I can fly. Fly. Back here. I need to get some antidotes before I even do anything. Although that would have been funny if um, poison <laughs> uh, kills uh, kills my Pokemon when I fly, I'll be messed up. <laughs> yeah, 
There we go. So yeah, it's doable. But let me just find out this trainer here. On Route 15. Level 29 Pokemon, huh? Yeah, I don't know if that's a bad one chance. Is that what I have up here? Um, Suzuka, yep. Namira, yep. Manian. Yep. I don't, uh, your? Yep. Uh, Kirkland is the one who I have up in here. And then, okay. Let's, uh. Let's see here. What am I doing here? Oh, I lost, um... Dang it, it just cleared out. <sighs> That's so annoying. I hate when it does that. You know, just deletes the whole thing um, on the OBS. Did I just finish? Yeah. The heck is it? No, I can't find it. Here it is. There. That's better. <laughs> okay, that looks a little better. So annoying that OBS does that. Very annoying. Alright, um... Let me go get the uh, antidotes because of the Ben and Nets and... And then... Do a 15-minute session. I got the... Uh, Ace with me, so I can always switch out if uh, if I take too many uh, big hits. See if I could get this uh, 200 XP going and speed up uh, speed this up a little bit. It's it's, it's just an insane how long it takes. Where's the no antidotes? How can you not offer up antidotes? Oh, that's annoying. Hold on. I'll have to fly somewhere else and find antidotes. Ah, oh, that's frustrating. Is it 
the Celadon. Great. <clears throat> Uh, man, I can't believe leveling up takes so long. Uh, I never realized, never, never realized just how much uh, um, leveling up it takes, given the, that this is the context of Nuzlocke. If this was just a regular playthrough, I would have like, yeah, um, I got 100, uh, 100 max revives. <laughs> Here are all the max revives. Uh, it's just, uh, um, oh, jeez, I'm gonna be set back 500 again. Fine. No, that's it. I just needed that. And the fact that I gotta try and get this whole, um, all this Pokemon up to... I still haven't even decided which team I want to go with. In terms of, I mean, aside from Gyarados... Um, I haven't exactly finalized the team, <clears throat> so that way I could focus on leveling up. Um, let me see here. Especially because um, Lapras is going to happen. Um, I'm gonna say I'm gonna end up getting Lapras. I'm gonna end up getting Hitmonchan. Uh, if I'm lucky enough, maybe I might be able to capture uh, Snorlax. So, in a sense, um, I'm gonna take. Uh, I'm thinking of taking Kirkland, um, Yor, Namira, uh, Darwin, Garp. Of course, Garp's gotta come along, and. Let's see here, and I'll probably will take uh, and take uh, Suzuka, the water type. So I'll have a water type, a dragon type, poison, grass psychic, uh, fire. No, no, I don't want a water type. I already gonna have a water type in Darwin. Yeah, you see what you see? You see what the problem is? <laughs> see, you see the problem I'm having here? <laughs> I don't have a big uh, a big pool here. So I don't know who I would want to um, really go with <clears throat> in the grand scheme of things. Hmm. I gotta wait until I can get some more Pokemon uh, to finalize them. But right now I need a team to be able to handle the gym leaders because they're at 37 and my team is at 25. Oh gosh. I have to get them up to 40. And I have no fat, and I don't know of a faster way um, to really level them up. Other than fighting the trainers, but I feel like I'm not up there yet with the trainers. Maybe if I could get them up to 28, I might be able to handle um, the trainers, and that'll help speed things up. But the um, wild Pokemon are just so low powered. It's like they don't give enough um, XP at this point. That's the thing that's driving me nuts. It's the fact that um, that they're not giving out enough XP. Oh, <clears throat> dang it! Got confused. Try again. All right, gonna have to switch. This is getting annoying. And then when things like this start to happen, then I gotta switch over to someone like Ace. And then instead of getting 200 XP, um, Suzuka is only gonna get 100. And that's what makes it even more slower.
And how much further? Just to get to... Yeah, see, I have to knock out at least 14 Pokemon. Just to get Suzuka up to level uh, 26. So that's why I'm wondering if I should just, you know, focus one Pokemon at a time um, for a whole session, you know, for, for a whole live stream. And, uh, and, and just, you know, get them up to 30 quickly. Crap. Gotta switch again. Hmm. Like, I can't really... Yeah, I can't take on Team Rocket's Rescue Lappers. I can't take on these Field Trainers. I have to get everyone up to level 30. This game doesn't give me um, room to breathe. <clears throat> Unless I go um, go to where the power plant is at, Route 10. Should go um, take a look at Route 11. Let me see, because uh, I really would love to optimize. Uh, really need to get that lo um, level up optimized. Gosh, Brilliant Diamond was just so good on the... Was so good with um, when it came to... Oh, this is 25. Yeah, Route 10... Where's Route 11? Oh, here's Route 11. Yeah. Alright. Uh, let me see how much... Uh, let me see if the, yield, uh, the experience point yield is good at Route 11. And forget the Diglett's Cave. <laughs> let me see. I forgot. This, uh, was it 200 or... Um, 10, 10 levels higher. Mm. Okay, well, it means damage, but how much XP do I get out of this? 124. Hmm. I tell you something. It really breaks the brain. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Route 12, right? I'm not sure if I took on all the fighters, um, all the trainers along Route 12. I know I cleared this out of um, with all the trainers. Let's see, route 12, route 12. Here we are. Isn't there grass around here? Yeah, there's uh, there's the grass. Uh, but I can't get to. I need. Oh, 
That's fine. Here we go. We got ourselves a trainer fight. How many Pokemon? Three. Okay. Goldeen, that's fine. That's all I want to do. Uh, level 28. Okay, let's swap out. I mean, I know it's a three level difference, but no way I'm gonna risk. Pack. Oh my gosh, that was... That was a lot of damage for confusion. Snap out of it. Ah, jeez. Okay, cool. There we go. Dang it, that wasn't even enough. Jeez. Fly. Stop taking these hits. See, that's what I'm talking about. Look at all that XP. All right. Mm. So we're dealing with a polywag. You know what? Let me bring Kirkland now. Kirkland's got grass. I don't think Kirkland's got. No, no, it doesn't have grass attack yet. It does have stun score. Bang. But it's not very effective. Here comes the dance. Ooh, this would have been... That's right. Nice. Um, nope, let's switch. Suzuka... Now that the uh, polywag is confused, hopefully, good. It stayed confused. Does it hurt itself? Oh, there goes sleep. All right, that's no problem. The important thing is, is that Suzuka gets the 300 XP. All right, Kirkland, <clears throat> snapped out of its confusion. Use double slap. <laughs> and critical hit, nice. All right, good. Okay, two hundred. That's fine. Horsey, yes, we will change Horsey. We'll change the Suzuka. Hmm. That reflect made a big difference too. Uh, let's switch out. Hmm. Sure. Mm. Hi, right, you know what? Let's switch over to your. Oh my gosh, that was way too much. Uh, that's because of the rain. Uh, switch over to Ace. Nope, Keen Eye. <laughs> Like, nope, you miss. Mm. 
Let's fly again. Don't miss. Dang it, I missed. <laughs> Didn't I say not to miss? Dang it. Everybody's gonna everybody's gonna get 50 XP. <laughs> um Yeah, sure, fine. Uh, I just don't want to switch again. Babush! <laughs> oh, no. Gotta go and get super potions. Heck. Gone. Yeah, 165. Uh, Ace caught up with uh, Garp. Alright, well, that's fine. Mirror move. What is mirror move? Uh, let's see here. Mirror move. Uh, Gen three. Counters the foe's attack with the same move. User does the last move used by opponent. Huh. Uses the previous move of an opponent, huh? Mm. Well, what does, uh, what does he have here? Well, he's got Leer. I don't think Leer is useful at this point. So... Sure, I'll drop that for a mirror move. Just for now. Until the next move. The next best move. There we go. And I just want to take on um, wild Pokemon. That's so annoying. Well, at least everybody survived. Fly. Does anybody know cut? Mm, let's see here. Did I teach anyone cut? No, right? Nobody learned cut. <sighs> no. Nobody learned cut. Diglett's Cave wasn't such a problem because they were so high powered. I would be leveling up in near hard. But they're so high level in that cave and they got freaking magnitude and earthquake. Fifteen to twenty-two, uh, twenty-nine to thirty-one. For, um, let's see, Doug Trio's twenty-nine to thirty-one, and Diglett is fifteen to twenty-two. So I can't even. So yeah, I might be able to take on a Diglett, but if I get a Doug Trio, their arena trap will, will, will pigeonhole me. Hmm. 
whole brain just like ah! it's like screaming out loud. There's some trainers here. There's a whole bunch of trainers here. Yeah, let's do it. And you should only have uh, magic carps. All right, four polywag. Yeah, level twenty-one. This is good. This is good. Um, smoke screen. Really? Polywag is that fast, huh? Blind it. Water gun. Yeah, this polywag is way too fast. Oh! Huh. Alright, my means got grass type. <laughs> Has a grass type attack. Let's do it. Magical leaf. Gone. Yep. That's uh bring Suzuka back. Let's see if I could be able to fight uh, fight this time. So, uh, so we could get all the XP. Dang it, that supersonic crap. Alright, fine, I'll switch to mining again. <laughs> so frustrating. Yay, but true. Yeah, well, here's Magical Leaf. Special. Yep. Maybe this time I'll uh, <laughs> be able to take, <laughs> take this Pokemon out. That doesn't matter, she's right there. Alright, fine, I'll just switch out. <laughs> No, soundproof doesn't work. <laughs> Magical leaf. Done. Finally, level 26. Uh. <laughs> Got ourselves a horsey here. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, gosh. Shift to Namira. Namira needs a lot of XP. Thunder Wave. Paralyzed. Dragon Rage. Yeah. Goes a smoke screen. Twister. Good. 373. Not bad. See, that's what I'm looking for. 300 XP. That that amount of XP to speed this up. Oh crap. Wow, from off the screen. Jeez. I didn't even get I didn't even get a chance to switch. Oh, okay, it's only one Pokemon. Alright, alright, alright. That's fine, that's fine. Uh, 27. Oh no, 27. That's not good. That's not good. Ah, it's a two level difference. <laughs> what could go wrong? <laughs> oh no. Dragon Rage. I should have Thunder Waved it. Oh, 
Thunder Wave. Good. So use the water support. <laughs> it thought it was fire. <laughs> Alright. Now I should be able to Thunder Rage it. Then I got first strike. Thunder Wave is so awesome. Teach every Pokemon Thunder Wave. <laughs> Too much. Alright, let me fly back and heal before I end up losing a Pokemon. Alright, back to here. Sit Suzuka out. Let's um Darwin in place of <clears throat> mm. I don't know, would this be a good team against the Elite Four? Like, concentrate all of my um, uh, training on these guys? Hmm. Before I go and take on another um, uh, trainer. Got a Dragon type, a Fire type, Psychic type, Poison type, Grass Psychic type, Water Flying type. Actually, I don't need two Psychic types, so I mean it's not really needed, really. <clears throat> And I already have a grass uh, psychic type. So I guess a normal type. A normal flying type. Yeah. Well, no, because I already have a flying type. Then Calyx would be the best one. Because Calyx can learn things like Flamethrower and Thunder. Alright. Yeah, that's probably going to be the case then. I don't need... At least until I get some uh, someone better, at least. Wait, wait, why, why are you here? There we go. <clears throat> so the team would look something like this. At least for now. Maybe I should run this team. Um, run this as a team. Get them all up to 30. Because I, I, as much as I would like to have the... Kingdra... I can get Dragon uh, Dragon Knight. Not only that, but my mean is so weak on the on the defense side. I took some major hits. All right, all right, all right. All right. Until I get some uh, get better Pokemon. Let me take on the trainers with this group. Try and get them all up to um, get some thirty. If I could get them to thirty, Diglett's Cave won't be a problem because I'll be swatting out all those Diglets with no problem, especially the Duck Trios. Alright, let's see. Should I fight this couple? Alright, let's take the mine. When I'll marry you. Yeah, double battle. G and Jess. Oh, how cute. But it's wrong! <laughs> The level 24s. Um, then we need some strat uh, strategies going on. Uh, sand attack. Blind. 
drop them accuracies. Wow, that was a lot of damage, all things considered. Mm. Nope. And I'll blind you on top of that. Huh? Oh, I thought... For you, we get the antidote. Where's the antidote? I bought antidotes. There we go. Use one antidote, uh, darling. Another helping hand. That's fine. Good. Now they're both paralyzed. Let's do the Twista. The problem is that one of them got poison, um, can poison. So. I don't want to physically hit them. Critical hit, nice. Throwing them twisters, keep sand attacking. Yeah, I got control over this fight. Kind of close. Good. They're gone. Uh, one of them's gone. Dang it, the other is still alive. Alright, I got quick attack. Oh, good. <laughs> Survived. And there's the poison, of course. But at what cost? <laughs> I wish I got some money. Fly back, heal. Oh, I can't fly back. That's right, I got antidote. I got the antidote, so I'm fine. Okay. Time for the antidote. Yep. Oh, man. <clears throat> well, they survived.
Hmm. I think I probably will do Route 10 then. What stinks is that if, if I lose this team... Oh, man. We, um... Okay. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. You'll see. You'll see. You'll see. Alright. Who do I have out here? Uh, got Namira. Uh, ah, yes. Use this one. So let's see here. I got uh, Namira, Darwin, Yor, Kirkland, Calix. Gotcha. who I got out. Alright, I'm just updating uh, the team. See if I could do one more fight and then go to the break. So now y'all know what I got um, on my team. Okay, Calyx is at 26, so I gotta get everybody up to 26 to catch up with Calyx. Um, Get some, uh, get some supplies. I mean, antidotes and. Um, antidotes, some potions. Just in case I'm too far away. Alright, here we go. 500. Yep. And jeez, so expensive. Dang it, I have to Alright, fine. Fine, fine, fine. Just wanna make sure I have some potions to work with. Dang it, because I wanna buy some TMs. See if I could get one more fight in, and then I think what I'll probably do, um, I'll probably do a crazy long session. Um, over at Route 10, even though I'm gonna be getting only one, uh, 100 XP. Ah, right, here he is. Here's another one. Mm. Be patient. Fate efficient is a waiting game. <laughs> How many you got? Two? Okay. Tentacle. Level 24. Okay. Alright, we got a fight here. Thunder Wave. Dragon Rage. Dang it, I hate that supersonic. So annoying. Mm. 
through it. Break through it. Break through it. Break through it. Good. She might get to level 20. Can she hit 26? Ooh, so close. <coughs> mm, excuse me. Alright. Now swap out. No, no Darwin. Um, with your? Sure. I'll switch with your. Battle of the Stinging. Um, one Poison Sting. Will I get the poison? No. Okay, how about Bite? Okay. There we go. Oh my gosh, that was a critical hit. Okay. Whew, got the first strike. Too close. Good, Namira's 26 now. And you are got a good chunk. See, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about, everybody. <laughs> I need that. I need that uh, 250. That 250. I need that. You know, that 200 experience points. 100 is just not cutting it at this point. Speaking of cutting it, uh, switch over. There you go. Things that Darwin's not gonna get flamethrower until level 54. That's why I wanted to get the TM early and just give it to, to Darwin right away. Unless of course, um, unless of course I could get a, another Fire type Pokemon um, over at Cinnabar Island. Yes. All right. All right, I'm gonna hit the. Let's take a four badges, man. Yeah. This is so tough. <laughs> yeah, so I guess I um, I guess uh, I guess I'm safe enough now that I could concentrate on these guys with no problem. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I might be able to have no problem um, raising these guys up at this point. Mm. I just gotta get them, get them to a spot where. Yeah, all right then. Where I can be able to deal with. Uh, this is... Yeah, with these trainers. Oh, gosh. <laughs> okay, I'll have to figure it out um, after the break. So, thank you all for joining me. I'll see you um, in uh, in a moment. <laughs> uh, with, uh, with more Nuzlocke uh, after this.